everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be talking about whether you need to go to art school. Firstly though, I just wanna say that this cow piece that I'm doing today is available as a print on my Etsy store, and I'll leave a link to that as a card up above and also in the description. All of the prints are really high quality and they all come hand signed as well. But anyway, let's get on with today's video. So the piece that I'm creating is using watercolours and I'm really enjoying doing this sort of style at the moment. I've been doing a lot of animals using this style so you're going to see a lot more animal pieces like this in recent videos coming up. So the materials that I'm using are all listed in the description as well if you want to check them out. But let's get started with our discussion. So what I'm discussing is whether you need to go to art school or whether you should go to art school and all of that sort of stuff. So I'm going to be going through the positives and the negatives and all of that. So firstly, I want to talk about my personal experience. So I've never gone to art school. I am pretty much self-taught. All I've done is like art GCSE and that was actually my lowest grade that I got for my GCSEs so I haven't had much sort of official teaching. I've learned a lot of my stuff through trial and error and also through a lot of YouTube videos so the only way I really got to where I am today is just through a lot of commitment, a lot of hard work, trial and error and lots of learning resources online. So firstly, I want to say that there is so many different resources online right now so you can pretty much go online and find tutorials on anything that you want to learn, whether it's fundamentals, a certain art style, certain medium or technique. There's so many free resources at the moment. And so a lot of what you get taught in art school, you can find online for free. And you can even find more and learn an unlimited amount of stuff. And so that's why I've improved and become where I am just through all of those free online resources. So also practice is what's going to help you improve. So even if you learn all the theories at art school, it's about applying that and doing it for yourself. So just because you learn this stuff at art school, it doesn't automatically guarantee that you're going to be a really great artist. You need to put in the time, put in the practice, and even if you learn lots of skills, you need to apply them and practice them basically. So one reason that I wasn't really keen on going to art school or getting an art degree is because it is very expensive, especially in other countries like America, it can be really expensive to go to art school. And you've got to kind of weigh up the pros and the cons as to whether it's actually worth it. Will what you learn at art school be like get you that head start will it be able to make you a successful artist or is it something that you're just going to put a lot of money into but you could have got the equal or even better opportunity just by looking stuff up online do you actually need it or is it better to just start building up your brand start creating a portfolio for yourself just practicing and learning a lot at home and just saving all of that money to put it into your business and create your brand, create your marketing and all of that sorts of stuff. So for me, I rather save the money, invest it into my business, buy my PC, buy my materials, buy all my setups so I can do all the video editing and really just learn about marketing. So even though you are doing art and you want to be an artist, it's also really, really important to know your business skills. You need to be really kind of business savvy and you need to understand marketing and how you're going to promote yourself, how you're going to get yourself out there, how you're going to get people to buy your artwork and become your follower, how are you going to get them to like you and want to kind of follow you. So that is just as important. So if you don't want to go to art school, you could go to business school, take some business classes. But again, you can get a lot of really great ebooks and books and videos online about businessing, marketing, social media, which is extremely important if you want to be an artist. You've got to be really on it with the social media. If you're amazing at arts, that doesn't mean that you're going to be able to get all of these people to follow you. If you cannot promote yourself and brand yourself, then you really haven't got much of a chance. Even if your work is absolutely incredible, it's all about how you're gonna get yourself out there nowadays. It's very rare that you're just going to get discovered. You have to put yourself out there and make it happen for yourself. And again, that is through hard work and commitment. That's not something that's just going to get given to you at art school. That's something that you're going to have to work for yourself. 
So those are some of the reasons that I decided that I didn't need to go, I didn't want to go, and I felt like I could just do the same thing at home and save a lot of money, a lot of time, and I didn't think it'd be that useful. But there are some beneficial things about going to art school. So firstly, you'll probably have personal tutors or people that you can go and ask to face-to-face, -face, get a direct sort of answer if you have any problems, if a technique's not working for you. If, some, if you have a problem with anything, you could probably go to someone ask them and get that sort of answer straight back whereas online you might not get a response you can post problems on forums or something and hope someone helps you out but you have someone on hand there that knows what they're doing is professional and has a lot of experience and can help you out with any sort of problems that you have so that is a really great thing and you have someone that's also coaching you tells you where you need to improve on and that is a really really great way to improve if you can't pick out yourself the kind of critiques and the problems in your artwork, then it's very hard to improve. So if you've got someone there to help you with that, then that is absolutely great. Also, it might get you into a really good habit of creating and practicing. If you're the kind of person that's quite lethargic, quite lazy, and finds it hard to get motivated to create a piece and get started on a drawing, or you find it hard to stick to a schedule, then going to art school might be really great at getting you into that routine, having that schedule so that you're constantly practicing every day to draw, you have deadlines, and you get used to doing it kind of to deadlines rather than just doing it when you feel it because that's a problem a lot of artists have is they just draw when they're in the mood. But if this is your job and this is your career, then you can't just draw when you're in the mood. You've got to be drawing every day. You've got to be on it. Even if you don't feel like it, you've got to do it. So art school could be really great at getting you into that routine, into that schedule and making you able to get used to drawing and painting, even if you don't necessarily want to that day. Also, art school, they might have some really great contacts if you want a certain career. A lot of them, maybe you have someone that can give you advice on where to go next after your sort of degree or schooling has ended. You might have that support network so you can ask and get advice on how you can go on to create a career out of this. Whereas if you're on your own at home, then it's very hard to get that sort of help and ask someone where are you going to go because you might not know anyone that's successful and experienced in that field so a lot of the art schools will have someone there to help you help you be able to kind of figure out where you want to go next with your artistic journey i suppose and also you will learn a lot of great techniques if you go to art school you will learn the methods you will learn the theories the fundamentals and if that's the kind of thing that you like so you like learning in that school environment then this will be for you because you will learn the skills and the techniques it's great if you can also then apply it yourself if you're good at that sort of stuff also, if you have quite a lot of money, then there's really no harm in it, but I wouldn't say it's necessary. I definitely didn't think that I needed to have an art degree in order to be a successful artist. Having that degree doesn't automatically mean that you're a better artist than someone that doesn't have that degree, because art is very subjective anyway. You don't need a degree, you don't need some sort of diploma to say that you can be an artist. If you learn yourself and you're good at art, then there's no reason to feel like you have to get a degree in it in order to be an artist. So if you're just going to art school because you think you need to go to art school to be an artist, then that's not the case. You can become an amazing artist just by learning yourself. But I definitely recommend learning the business side of it as well. That is really, really important. So yeah, overall, I would say that it isn't completely necessary to go to art school. In my opinion, I wouldn't, I wouldn't see the value in it, especially for the high cost of it. So for me, I don't think it's that necessary. It's definitely not essential in order to become an artist, but there's definitely some good points to it as well. I hope you enjoyed this. I'd love to know what your thoughts are. What do you think? Do you think it, you need to go to art school? Do you think you should go to art school? Let me know in the comments section below. If you enjoyed this video, then please give it a like and I'd really appreciate it if you could give it a share as well. For you guys that are enjoying this painting as well, I am going to be having 
four real-time versions of this as tutorials complete with voiceover so you can follow along with me at your own pace available on my patreon very very soon so i'll leave a link in the description and a card up above so that you can check that out anyway guys thank you for watching and i will see you in my next video bye everyone